Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Okami. Last time we found some more places in the Suta Ruins. I know that's not very descriptive. Oh, we beat up a lot of Devil Gates, I remember that. And we found the source of the disgusting waterfall that's like evil on little levels of water. It's these ever flowing, flamey, gross pots. Let's examine them. Check out these pots! Poisonous water spilling out of them! I bet this is what's been harming the natural beauty amid the ruins. Yeah, as you can see, we have the. Oh crap. Uh, don't worry about that, that just popped on the screen. The battery for my other controller is low. It's not the one I'm using. I just switched controllers because that one was low. Um. Here, wait one second. Let me hook it up to the watt. To, um, the charger, so. Yeah, I don't. I just don't have to worry about that. Well, no, I won't interrupt the video for that. Here, let's just do our stuff. Smash these pots. Yeah, as you can see, the waterfall's flowing into the water. Then this grossy stuff is spewing out and making the water disgusting. But we can fix that by doing so. Oh, and we get a cutscene because it's that awesome. Look at that, we fixed the water. Now it's not as disgusting. Well, actually, no, it's crystal clear. Oh, and doesn't that make the Suta Ruins look a lot better with less evil? And it even made islands. That's cool. See, look, and we got 20 praise. That was a lot. <laughs> Super praise bubble. Yes. <laughs> well, it looks like the poison that was polluting the water is completely cleared up. Now it looks like a great place for a swim. There's even a water ball. I bet it'd be loads of fun to go straight down it. Um, what I meant was a playful dog, like you me might do that. But I haven't forgotten about what you're lo we're looking for, have you? And of course, <laughs> I haven't given up on hunting down some treasure either. Yes, Asian. Go after your treasure, and I will go after my dog. Did I invert the... Oh, dang it. I messed with the... Uh, I accidentally went into options earlier. I messed up the... My lovely camera controls. Crap. Yup, saying Suta Ruin Map. Suta Ruin Map. Map displaying the structure's details. Chap check map at blah 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 screen. One second, let me go change that in the options. I'm sorry, guys. I'm messing up today. Uh, where's my options? I don't want to, like, run around with this. It's not necessarily my most favorite thing. Okay, I'll just deal with the pain of having an inverted thing. You know what? Just for fun. Oh yeah, but we got the map of the ruins. I need to show you that. Yeah, now we can see what the ruins like. You can see the first floor, second floor, third floor, fourth floor, and it shows the rooms we haven't been in. Notice how in the third floor there's a long corridor and then just a big circular room that leads nowhere. Hmm, I, I wonder. Almost seems boss-like. Actually, I'm not sure if that's the boss room or some other room. Because I know there's another room that's really important. Just not sure. Hmm. Weeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
And what's in here? Oh, wow. Look at this. This is pretty. Really mysterious, though. Lots of dead grass. Let's fix that up. So obviously making the room look bad. Oh, look. We, we fixed the grass and a spring started running. And look at all these plants. Personally, I think this is one of my favorite rooms in the game, just because it looks so pretty when you refresh it. Oh my goodness, I love it. It's great looking. You can use the power bloom to fill it in, just blah blah blah. You're, I'm Ishin, and I'm telling you what you already know. But yeah, this room looks so pretty when you heal it up. It's just gorgeous, my goodness. Praise bubbles. Nom, 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 nom. That was a new praise level noise. I don't think I'm going to use that one as often. That one's a little weird. <laughs> but hey, I'm weird. Heal. And yes, we just cleaned up the room majorly. See, look at that. That's really pretty. Ten praise bubbles. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, I used it again. Oh, praise bubbles. There we go. See, look at this place is really pretty. I'm sorry, it's great. Oh, oh, and that bud popped open. It's not a peach anymore, it's a flower. Like a lily. Oh, and you know what this means? Hey, look, that light. There's a constellation here, too. A constellation inside a building? <laughs> Oh, this one's more... That one's easier to tell what it is. It's a monkey with some symbols. Yay. Yay. Monkey. Psh, I'm a monkey. Hello. He's gonna throw his symbols up and do a flip. Major shinies. Nice landing, friend. Come on, oh. No one's perfect, monkey, don't worry. I got it, hopefully. <laughs> um, this name's, this guy's name's Sutagami. Uh, you know, like, Suta ruins? Sort of makes sense. The symbols are a little annoying, though. Ah, uh, Amaterasu. Origin of all that is good and mother to us all. I, Sutagami, the last in the triumvirate of Hanagami Floor Gods, have humbly awaited your glorious return for a hundred years. May the fresh spring growth bloom from your snow-white form. Bring new life to the land that suffers under evil. Monkey, monkey, yay! A new brush technique! That was Sutagami, the third and final god of Flora. He's the god that can make vines do his bidding. One folktale tells how Sutagami used that power to tie vines to his body so that he could fly through the air. Hey, that's a Kohana Blossom, a flower of the gods over there. Try making a vine sprout right out of it. Okay, here's Bloom Technique in action. You, you draw a line from the bud to Amaterasu, or Amaterasu, and you fly up there. Nice, easy travel to places. Perfect. Wow, it surely sure is handy to have a god around. You can draw out vines when the Kohana Blossom is open. Let's look around and see if any others are blooming. Oh, let's look up there. Oh, inverted controls. Pa. Um, another one. Oh, no. Oh, I hate these inverted camera controls so much. It was a total accident when I hit them. My goodness. Uh, oh, there's another one. Oh, but we'll have to go up farther in these blossoms in the next episode of Let's Play Okami. See you guys next time. Goodbye.